Yes, sir. It was good, YouTube, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we have another statue by Iron Studios. This time, we have Raphael from the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle line. Very excited, man. We finally have the complete set of the four brothers. And yeah, man, we just waiting on the rest of the proximity pieces. So let's go ahead and open up the box and check this one out. All right, so here we have, what, six pieces. We got the base, Ralph, two arms, a hand wheel, and some rebar. All right, so let's take a look at the base here. Once again, amazing attention to detail here. I love the graffiti here on the back of the base. Looks very nice on that brickwork. And then just more of that wet uh, look to the, uh, the pipes and everything. Looks very dope. And then we have the slime, the ooze, uh, coming out of the uh, the drain there and then on this base man we have a Mauser head which is very dope uh, this is one thing that's not on the other bases all right so now let's insert Ralph onto the base And then we'll insert the hand wheel. Next, we'll insert his left arm. And then we'll insert the right arm. And then here is that rebar that I mentioned earlier. We won't show it here, but it does add some extra detail to the base. So here we are with Raph on the turntable, looking angry as always, ready to fight. And I am loving it. Just like with the other statues, Iron Studios did an excellent job with the attention to detail. From the shell to the color scheme, everything just looks amazing. I'm really loving this mug on his face, man. You can just tell that he's ready for action and anybody can get it. All right, man, and then here we are uh, with Ralph just lunching. And I love, man, I love this pose that he's in. Uh, just ready to leap forward and uh, yeah, man, we just loving everything about this statue, man uh, The different shades of green uh, You can see that it's a little lighter on the bottom of his foot there. That's excellent attention to detail there The knee pads just everything just looks awesome here, man I'm really loving it and then right here, man continuing uh, that Mauser head man is very dope, man I'm surprised that this is the only base with a Mauser on it uh, but I'm loving that they did include that in one of the statues. So uh, not really sure if it'll be on any of the other statues. I don't recall seeing it. But I'm loving the fact that they did include that to kind of keep it classic with the Ninja Turtles. Alright, so here we are, man, in full view. Uh, Raphael looking amazing here. Very nice, man. Really just loving this statue. I mean, from top to bottom, this is definitely a 10 out of 10 in my opinion. Loving everything about it. Let's go ahead and check him out with his brothers. All right, so here we are in the display and I'm honestly, I'm honestly at a loss of words, man. I'm going to try to put something together for you real quick, but this is just really blowing my mind. Like, Raphael, man, is definitely a great addition to this display, and I'm just really loving everything about this line. Uh, you can kind of see the rebar pieces that I, I added in there. Uh, you can see those, and it does add some extra attention to detail like I mentioned earlier. But yes, man, just the overall presence of these four turtles, just, man, I'm, I'm really digging it. And at first when they announced that they was coming out with the Ninja Turtle line, 
I was wondering like if it was going to be like off the 1990s movies or if it was going to be based off the new movie. Uh, but they just kind of put their own spin on it, man. And I'm really digging what they actually came up with. Uh, this entire line so far from what I've seen uh, is going to be impressive. You know, every character, I love the uh, the creative aspect behind them. And, uh, and I think they did an excellent job. I'm pretty sure we should be getting Casey, um, April O'Neil. Uh, those will probably be the next two that comes out, uh, which would be dope because I know we can add them to in this display here. And, uh, and it's going to be awesome, man, once we finally get everybody uh, displayed. So looking forward to that, man. That'll probably be within maybe the next six months to a year. Uh, we should have all of the characters hopefully closer to that six months than a year, but we shall see. Uh, I know the uh, estimated time can be kind of off sometimes, so it just kind of depends on production, uh, the manufacturers and stuff like that. So hopefully we get them sooner rather than later. But just make sure that y'all leave a comment down below telling me what y'all think about the line and make sure that y'all hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, make sure that you're subscribed and make sure y'all click that notification bell so you don't miss any videos. We do have some more videos coming soon. Until the next time, peace.